Factoring a trinomial, we want to see if we can write it as a product of binomials that are going to fit in here. Because there's no coefficient next to the uh, x squared, we know that the first term of each of these is going to be x. So that's x and that's x. Now we need to focus on the 12 and find factors of 12 that add up to negative 7. I like to just ignore, for the time being, the sign, and just think of factors of 12 itself, rather than uh, um, worry about this being negative. But quickly, I might notice that 3 and 4 is equal to 7, which means that negative 3 and negative 4 is going to be negative 7. Also, negative 3 times negative 4 is still equal to positive 12. Therefore, this is going to factor as a minus 3 and a minus 4. That's it. This expression, x times 3 and x minus 4, is algebraically equivalent to this trinomial. It's in factored form because now it's written as one thing times another. We can check that by actually doing the FOIL process. So, so doing so, x times x is equal to x squared. If I do x times Remember, it's going to have to take the minus into account, so it's x times minus 4, so it's going to be minus 4x. Again, I have to take the minus into account here. Minus 3 times x is going to be minus 3x. And for the final term, the last term in my FOIL, I have a minus 3 and a minus 4. So two negatives is going to give me a positive 12. And we can see that this is the same as my original up here because minus 4 and minus 3 are equivalent to minus 7. So that does work out, and this expression is equivalent to this one, but in factored form. It's written as one binomial times another binomial. Thank you.